good morning. We are leaving Kentucky. Well, we just woke up in Kentucky at a rest stop. Probably the cleanest rest stop we've ever been to, if I'm being honest. And we are gonna go to the gas station because I gotta get gas. But we are about 15 hours from Colorado, so good luck to us again. Pretty long drive, but it's worth it at the end. I just hit a thousand miles on the road trip so far. We still have 800 miles to go until we get to Colorado. On to Kansas City we go. All right, so we made it to, well, we're in the middle of Kansas at the moment. And to be honest with you, it is very windy over here. And it is beautiful. I, I know that some people might say that driving through Kansas is boring, but this is the first time I've seen like planes. And it is so cool. I love seeing it. I literally am from Florida and there's absolutely nothing there. So I'm extremely happy that we passed by here because otherwise, it, I just have no words. I love seeing different states and I like seeing the different cities as well. I, I think our favorite so far has been St. Louis uh, just because it's just been, it was a really cool city. There's a lot to see there and yeah. And we're just excited to continue on our journey. Crazy. Guys, we are in awe. Like, we're I moving here. I believe this. We're moving here, forget Georgia. On our way to Breckenridge, it's 47 minutes, only an hour from where we were staying last night. We have it's to stay. literally insane. Like, I don't think you understand this. It, the views are just, I'm, I'm like, I'm at a loss of breath. Literally and physically, I can't breathe. But, because <laughs> the elevation, but it is so cool. Breckenridge dude this is wild this is so crazy um, we have stuff to do at the moment like run errands basically and Millie literally is scared to climb up the stairs come on Millie there you go do you have to pay oh wait I didn't even think about that I'm gonna go check anyway yeah we have to run like some well not errands but we have to basically like work in a way where we we're about to run over to a coffee shop and upload a video actually finish this week's video um it's just gonna be us coming here so you know but it's kind of crazy that this town is literally surrounded by mountains like literal mountains it, i don't know how to explain it look at this that's crazy that is crazy i love it Keep in mind, this is our first time at this high of elevation, so it's, it's actually really hard to breathe. But hopefully our bodies will like acclimate to it, because, dude, this is crazy. I love the fact that there's like overlanding trucks every single block you go to. It's weird because we've never experienced this, but there's snow everywhere and it's hot. Like there's, it's just hot. I don't know how you're hot. <laughs> it is hot it's not cold but we were just trying to upload the video and didn't really work out that well the wi-fi and the coffee shop was bad and we only got to like five percent within like what like 30 minutes so we decided not to upload it right now i transferred it over to my phone and we're gonna see if we can upload it on my phone so same thing at coffee shops is definitely a learning curve because we have absolutely no idea how other people do it. 
and how and if they do stay at a coffee shop for like three hours or four hours if we have to do that then that's fine but right now we're trying to get as much out of uh, Breckenridge as we can so we're just gonna enjoy it and if we have to upload it later then we'll go ahead and upload it later um, yeah and we want to go to Vail too and we're gonna camp at Grand Junction tonight so there's a lot that we need to do so that's why we decided to just stop it for now and I'm waiting on the iCloud to upload on mine and it's just a mess so it's a learning curve like I said we'll get there I think you understand how incredible this is, seriously. This, the camera doesn't do it justice, but that's huge. Like, that is huge, bro. Like, I am geeking over this. I cannot believe that. And then there's just a frozen lake right behind us. We decided to stop at a scenic area, uh, just cause uh, I saw how tall the mountain was and I could not help myself. It's, it's literally the most beautiful thing I've ever seen. I, it, it makes me almost emotional to see this because this is crazy. It's just wild. be a little windy we found uh, a little national park area it's called the Colorado Monument Park I think that's what it's called and it is it's paid but there's showers and stuff like that so I think we're gonna work before we head into Moab because in Moab we're gonna try to strictly be on BLM land um, we might stay here tonight because I mean dude this is the craziest thing I've ever seen, seriously. It's just like, what? It's just beautiful. There's no other words to it. This is probably the craziest experience I've ever, ever had. And then we came from down there. So now we're gonna go ahead and try to make it up to the campsite. Um, because it's like a 38 minute drive. <laughs> you guys are so cute. It doesn't look real, in all honesty. It does not look real. Guys, I know you guys can't like actually see what is going on but these drops are insane and I get to see it I'm sitting in the passenger I get to see these drops I want to see them but and Gabriel's upset he's missing out on them I feel like puking This is crazy. And then just a weird little thought, like there's a hole in the mountain. 
and there's literally nowhere to get up there unless I'm maybe wrong but oh wait there is a trail I don't know well, I'm not too sure maybe there is a trail I wouldn't do it but personally we're on our way to um, to a spot that I found in BLM land because I feel like we've been lied to maybe you guys can correct me in the comments but we there was apparently supposed to be a camp spot here in the Canyonland monument park whatever and we literally haven't found it so I went on my app and I found a little another spot closer to Utah um, because we're still in Colorado so we're here we're here and this is insane literally I Michelle besides Michelle having a heart attack every like five minutes I have asthma <laughs> <laughs> yeah but yeah this is crazy like and then we've seen like mountain goats like just hanging out like near cliffside. I got a couple photos of them. I might put them up, but it's so cool. We made it to our first first BLM campsite. And I'm surprised the camera's actually picking me up because it is getting dark over here. This is so sick. It's literally in the middle of nowhere. And it's so quiet. Do you hear that? Last night was so loud. Where were we? Oh, we stayed at Walmart. We stayed at Walmart last night. But dude, this is just like be quiet. Okay. <laughs> Millie starts crying. <laughs> dude, this is sick. I I wouldn't even mind staying in the tent tonight. We just got here from Michelle being almost scared to death by a canyon, and now we're out here in the middle of the, like of nowhere. And we're still in Colorado, but tomorrow morning we will be officially in Utah. I finished up food. We're just gonna eat and then head to bed. And we'll see y'all in Utah. Bye. Bye.